Hello everyone, welcome back to Outside the Workshop. So I wanted to take and show you guys real quick a uh, stand that I built for my pipe threader that I picked up. Uh, it didn't come with a stand and I think that the, maybe this will help you out if you do have a pipe threader and you want to build a stand. I'm going to show you how I built mine real quick today. This is just going to be a real quick video and uh, I really hope you enjoy it. So let me spin you on around and I will show you what it looks like. Okay, so here we are. This is my uh, pipe threader that I picked up the other day. I just kind of did a little tarp thing where I showed it under the under the tarp. Didn't really go into much detail with it, uh, but I had some questions about it. And the main purpose of this video is to show you show off the stand that I built for it. So I took and put on hard rubber wheels with a little single bar axle there. You can pick those up at Harbor Freight, pretty cheap. And the whole thing is constructed pretty lightweight out of angle iron. Uh, the expanded steel grate was from a trailer that I had built for a guy or a tailgate of a trailer. I've got some videos to that. I'll put a link to that in the uh, up here in the card and down in the description down below where I built the little trailer gate there. It was like a little time lapse thing. But uh, yeah, so I got a place here in front where I can wheel this thing around. And some of the places, some of the things to take and point out about this is that it has a slight lean that way. And the reason for that being is this machine has an automatic oiler right here, a cutting oil, cutting oiler, if you will. And so that thing right there has an oil tray down in here and a pump and it pumps that oil up and out there and oils the threads as you're cutting uh, automatically. So that's a good thing. But yeah, the machine came with, the machine came with two dies. This one here goes from one inch all the way to two inch. And then this one here goes from half inch up to three quarter inch. Uh, they're adjustable dies. So those are the two that came with it. Once again, a stellar deal. Uh, I got this from a guy who uh, has always been very helpful in supporting me on my way in this blacksmithing journey. And uh, you know, and so he got it on the cheap and so he gave it to me on the cheap, which you can't ask for better than that. But here's a little walk around of it, like I said, a little 360. But yeah, this is basically the stand I built for it. I've been asked if I'm going to be doing any videos on what, what I'll be doing with it. Yes, there'll be some videos where I'll be using this machine um, to do certain things like for plumbing and things. And uh, I'll, I might even do a video, you know, showing how to use it and use one of these machines. Uh, but yeah, anyways, that's just a real quick update vid on that pipe threader that everybody was curious about. Hope you enjoyed it. And like always, God bless you, and we will catch you on the next one. Thanks for watching.